So we've um, moved to a different hotel. Uh, we're at the Villa Navarro Resort in Cabba. So this is the room that we've just got. It's um, it's, it is a deluxe room or VIP room. And uh, here we go. It's Jessica sitting on the bed. There's our bed. Got aircon over yonder. Yep. Dimmer lights. Uh, it's it's fairly small, but it's it's nice. You've got in the bathroom here. You've got the shower there, and you've got a big spa bath, which is handy. And around the other side here with the toilet. So there's the toilet. Little table over here where we can uh, connect our computer. So we'll see how the Wi-Fi goes. Yeah, as I say, it's small, but it, it's cost us about. They gave us a 20% discount, uh, 2,200 a night, pesos that is, so that's about, I don't know, 60, 60 odd dollars Australian. And at least we're going to feel safe here. We didn't uh, sleep at all after the incident in Sea of Dreams. And it also has a nice little balcony out here as well, which is nice. We'll have a little look around here. Hot day, very glary today. So you've got a little souvenir shop here. What have they got here? Welcome family and friends, happy hour. 230 pesos a bucket. Little family cottages along here. Play area for the kids. So there's a swimming pool over this way. A few little bar areas around here, so this is one of them. Beautiful day. See the flags blowing in the wind there. Little kids down there having a look at the water. something something up there got little friends there so all in all it looks very nice main thing is we all feel much safer here after what happened there in the last place where they got into that room so easily. Some birds in there, look a bit sleepy but they're in there. And here we are, Villa Navarro. And just outside the resort here it's, it's a bit of a waterway and Looks like some sort of an old house that used to be there. I don't know if it's if there's still anyone lives there. I don't think that water is fit to swim in. I think there is a bit of sewage going into there. You can smell it. Probably from the resort itself here, I imagine. 
so I wouldn't be jumping in there in a hurry. Anyone for volleyball? Seems to be a lot of volleyball nets around the place here in Cabba. They might seem to like volleyball. So there we go, that's a bit of a look around. Hope everyone's doing well. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, on first looks here, the staff are very friendly. The, uh, the rooms are smallish but look very good. And the uh, amenities and the beach is amazing.